The Marchfield Air Museum has one of the rarest aircraft in World War II history in its collection. They are the caretakers of this Bell P-59A Aerocomet, America's first jet fighter. Conceived in absolute secrecy, it was born from Project MX-397 in 1942, a direct result of Britain's decision to share its revolutionary Whittle turbojet. General Electric reverse-engineered the design into the twin J-31 engines you see under the wings here. Bell built the P-59 in Buffalo, New York, and shipped the prototypes to Muroc Army Air Field, now Edwards AFB, disguised under fake propeller spinners to confuse onlookers. The first flight took place on October 1, 1942, making the U.S. the second Allied nation to fly a jet aircraft after England. The P-59A was fast for its time at 400 miles per hour, but they proved underpowered, heavy, and outclimbed by piston fighters like the P-38 Lightning. Only 66 era comets were built, and they were primarily used for pilot training and data collection. This survivor, serial 4422614, is the only P-59A preserved in its original configuration. Planes of Fame is restoring a P-59 prototype, seen here from my 2019 visit. It represents a vital learning curve between the prop-driven legacy of World War II and the dawn of the jet age. For aviation historians, it's not just a museum piece. It's the bridge between the P-51 Mustang and the F-86 Sabre between propellers and afterburners.